we fall within what's called the cool climate um, viticultural zone, which suggests that our growing season temperature on average, so growing season being from April to October, is around or above 13 degrees Celsius. And that's the starting point for the cool climate classification that's been observed in other wine growing areas around the world. So we're at the bottom end of that, but what we found significantly was over the last 10, 15 years, nearly every year has been above that threshold, suggesting that actually the average conditions for producing um, the varietals we've talked about in the, in the southeast, south central UK are suitable. I think it is recognised that yes, you know, out there globally, um, we could be seen as an example of an area that's potentially profiting from climate change. You could say almost exploiting the conditions that are now in front of us, whereas other wine producing areas are um, suffering. They're looking at adaptation strategies. There's a lot being written about potential migration to cooler areas such as the UK that are seen as more viable. And it was really those ideas that drove the research. We wanted to see, well, if someone's suggesting a move from uh, one area of one wine producing area of the re world to another, i.e. say, let's say southeast of England, how viable are those conditions at this point in time? Is now the time to be making that move? Or as future research we're engaged in is going to potentially show us, is there a future period of time that's actually going to be even better? Mm -hmm.